It's relations radiation from another generation yeah. Making makers out of me and out of you Out of you Open worlds of inspiration Fabrication celebration If you dream it, you can make it You can make, make your dreams come true Wake the population, imagination, illumination Manifest your destination, make your space Exceed all expectations and exclaim the declaration, yeah We can make the world a better place If you dream it, you can make it If you make it, you can be it That's the way that you be that That's the way that for the journey. Got any more cookies? Because we need to go far away from here. Deep breath, Stev. Be one with the cookies. And then tell me what's wrong. Parchment pond is glowing, which means it must be haunted. A glowing pond? That sounds cool. Why would we want to leave town? Because, Cammy, the only logical reason that a pond would be glowing is because it's haunted. By ghosts! A bunch of them must have moved in last night. Not sure logical and haunted can be used in the same sentence, but go on. And hand me a cookie. Hmm. Fabio doesn't seem like himself. He's not doing that super cute swimming in circles thing. I don't get it. He has food, his water's clear. What could be wrong? Maybe Fabio's bored. You should put something new and fun in his tank, like a pineapple. Of course. Why didn't I think of that? I'll ask Jax. He's taking our science class to the bog to study water samples today. Ooh, ooh, tell him about my pineapple idea. <laughs> oh, absolutely. This is a bold scope. It makes teeny tiny things look 100 times bigger, so you can actually see them. It's made with paper, a magnifying lens, and a light. Ooh. These water samples were taken from different depths of the pond. Any idea why? There might be different organisms at different depths. Nice, Kaylee. The pond has different plants and microorganisms, depending on where sunlight is able to reach. Ooh, cool. There are all sorts of critters moving around on my slide. What's this one? Ooh, that right there is a protozoa. <gasps> I adore its little shape with all the wispy things helping it swim. Hey, Jax, my goldfish is glum and I don't know why. He's not even eating. Any ideas? Have you checked his water? It looks totally clear. Did you see all the things living in that bog water? You might need to take a closer look. Here, let me know what you find. There's definitely something in this water besides water, but what? Oh, that's a protozoa. Reese, quick, I need more info. Hmm, oh wow. What? Just a sec. No way. Reese! Okay, as it turns out, that pesky protozoa is to blame. It's making Fabio sick. The site says we need to get an ultraviolet light. Ultraviolet light? Isn't that what gives you sunburns? I don't think Fabio would like wearing sunscreen. UV rays can cause sunburns, but they also clean things by killing bad bacteria. And it's safe for fish. It also says here we should get a water plant to create more oxygen in the water and help good bacteria grow. Side note, tank decor gives fish a place to hide and feel safe and helps reduce boredom. Aha, uh -huh. I knew it. Fabio needs an extreme tank makeover. I don't think that was the most important. I'm going to sketch some designs. Do not disturb me. Hey, Cammy, what's up? It's Dev. He's totally freaked out. He's convinced Parchment Pond is haunted. Aw, poor Dev. Kay and I are on the way. Great. Just no sudden movements. Trust me, he's very jumpy right now. And this is all because Parchment Pond is glowing? Dev's definitely right about the pond glowing, not about it being haunted, which is ridiculous. Unless, maybe the water is filled with tiny little ghosts that are hard to see? Well, we know something about finding weird things in water. Got any paper in this place? <laughs> Lock the door! 
door. Don't let the ghosts in. Are these the ghosts in question? No, but they're holding the ghosts hostage in the tubes. Ah, the glowing pond water. I have a hypothesis about that, but my microscope is broken. Here, use ours. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, my hypothesis was correct. It's... I knew it! Scary, creepy ghosts! No, <laughs> no! It's green algae. Specifically, a species of single-cell dinoflagellate that exhibits bioluminescence when disturbed. But is it dangerous? For the fish? Forget the fish! What about us? Absolutely not. This particular algae is completely harmless. You feel better, Dev? And you were so worried. Boo! Ah! That green is so pretty when it lights up in the water. I know somebody who'd love this color. Welcome to Club Fabio. Lights! UV lights. They kill bacteria and look good doing it. Ooh, is that a pineapple? Yep. Jax helped me make those with the 3D printer. See how happy Fabio is now? This is fantastic. I brought Fabio a little tank warming gift, too. Let's get this party started. Woo-woo! Yeah! <laughs> it's a dance party. Come on, Fabio. 